All right. Uh, good evening, everyone. Sorry for the late start. But uh, oh, welcome to another Lazy Anonymous Gamer stream. This is your host, Alaris. And tonight we'll be playing Earthbound, the classic SNES game. Um, as you can see in the top right corner of the stream, we have nine days until the Extra Life event. Where we will, or at least at least me, potentially other members of LAG, depending. Um, but at least some of us probably will be playing uh, video games for 24 hours straight to raise money for children's hospitals. Um, this year, like every year that I've done so far, which I think will be year nine, um, we'll be raising money for John Hopkins Children's Center. Um, so, hopefully... Uh, you guys can tune in. I mean, we'll be raising money from now until the end of the year, but game day is November 5th. Um, and we'll have the tally up here in the corner. Should be smaller in the uh, actual game screen, but we'll bring that up in a few moments. Um, all right, just give me a moment here to get this set up. All right, let's see. All right, so um, overlay pending to change, um, depending on what we get set up by game day, but we'll have this up for now. Um, when last we left our intrepid heroes, we arrived in, uh, I wanna say Saturn Valley, Saturn Village, whatever you wanna call it. Either way, it's a, very weird place. Um, where did we last leave off? <laughs> Level 22, 18, and 19. Oh, Paula's finally passed up Ness in Psychic Points. So she's definitely the squishy mage type. Um, doesn't even have more offense, though, so she's not kicking out more damage. Just more uh, Psychic Points. Either way, um, let me see, okay, right, so that is actually working, just wanted to make sure, um, okay, um, so I actually think we went through everything in Saturn Village, kind of, before we left, um, Goodness, inventories are really, really full. Um, is there a place to sleep so that... Oh, let's see. Dr. Saturn Zoom, I repair your body. You all fixed up, boing. Didn't even cost me any money this time, nice. Alright, um... Do you want to slumber? Yeah, sure. Maybe working through the night, Jeff fixed the broken spray can. Became defense spray. Alright, um... Yeah. Bad key machine, right. Um, what does Sudden Guts Pill do? <laughs> Doubles your guts during battle. I don't remember what Guts does. Sure, it does something. 60 HP. Alright, cool. <laughs> Ness chewed a piece of bubblegum, but it wasn't as satisfying as food. Nice. Um, actually, yeah, let's. S Cargo Express. Yaha. Yeah. Can you send somebody out to pick up my stuff, please? Uh, 
I know it's a it's a bit of a journey out here, but I mean would very much be helpful. Oh! Shoot, nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just take um Um, I guess, yeah, uh-huh, take all that. I don't even know what the Rust Promoter does, though, so. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm still recovering from illnesses. Um, I guess I should leave some inventory space open, so. Okay, uh, hmm. I think we're all healed up, so. Yep. Come on, Jeff. Jeff, Paula, and Ness. I think this is just back the way I came, though, so... What are you... Oh, you're an enemy. Oh, okay. You were an enemy I very easily defeated. I, I wasn't expecting a duck to be an enemy. It shows me. Maybe it was a goose. The goose from Unnamed Goose Game. <laughs> Alright, I, I, I guess I have to go back the way I came. Hi, Mr. Bug. Oh. Hi, Mr. Violent Roach. <laughs> Thank you for the EXP, Mr. Violent Roach. Tried to spread its wings on Ness. That's weird. There's a bottle rocket inside. That... going to Jeff. He seems like the type to be able to do something with a bottle rocket. Oh. Jeff's body solidified. Go, go team, I guess. Alright, sure. You all want to die? That's fine by me. One damage to arm Armored Frog. A whole damage. <laughs> Ouch! Nope, didn't hit. Oh, he's crying now, and apparently that didn't really mean much. Oh. 
it's all just... Alright, just, just burn him with fire. <laughs> all leveled up, sweet. And Sci-Fire B. Jeff hit 20. Nice. Let's, um... Actually, I don't think she's lost much. Yeah. So that was kind of, that was a little bit of a waste, but it's fine. All right. Farm zombie and cohort. Sure. Sci-fi or B. Oof. Poor Jeff. damage she became tame cool that still hurt a lot nice all right is that photo photo guy cool <sighs> okay get ready uh, fuzzy pickles Say the password. Say the password. See, I think I remember something about the Saturn Village, where one of them said what the password was. Or potentially that... I think it was like you have to stand around? Question mark? Uh, we can try that for like a minute and see if anything happens. Um, and if nothing happens, then we can go back and see what they said the actual password was. So, how are you all doing? Uh, good? Good. Okay. Cool. Because, um... This is, uh... Boring. Um... <sighs> Alright. Um... 
So I'm curious how long this game actually is. So to, to get the ball rolling on, on, on talking about something at least. Um, I'm curious how long this game actually is. Because it's one of the... Well, it's the JRPG that started a lot of the trends. And... Um, I wonder if one of the trends that started was them being ridiculously long. I mean, I've got three out of the four party members already. In, I think, three sessions of playing, so about nine hours, give or take. Um, and this is, I think, session four. We actually got through the first three towns, uh, Annette, Tucson, and Threed. And I think we should be on our way to four sides soon. Though I don't know if we actually got through Threed. I, I think we sort of did. But there was a boss for three, the uh, the Belch guy, um, who he beat at a little miniature version of. But um, oh shoot, nice. Okay, you may enter. I guess it was just to stand around. Um, <laughs> there's no one here. Okay, cool. Um, did you bring some fly honey? It's Master Belch's favorite. Yes. Hey, be careful. Be sure you don't drop it. Oh, only one of you will actually let me through, though. Poppy and his cohort, Foppy B. Alright, we're, we're just gonna... Swing. <laughs> Can you not do that, though? Smash. Go, Paula. Sweet. Alright. Actually, curious. What's behind the door? A metric ton of zombies. Alright. Sci fi or B? The laughing hysterically, attacking, and then the standard attack. Alright, so we only have one left to bash. Yay, zombies, I guess. <clears throat> Hopefully, there's something good back here. Let's see, there's a bomb inside. Ness takes it. I actually, once again, that is in better hands of Jeff. Here, Jeff, you can have the bombs in the group. <coughs> no, no, not Ness. Dang it. Um... What do you do? Drink this recover 80 HP. I don't want to use that. Um, you have two croissants. Give one to Paula. And how are you today, Jeff? You're fine. All right. So they have about 200 HP, probably. <laughs> Jeff is level 21. He gained almost no stats at all. Alright, let's go downstairs, I guess. Holy crap, that's a lot of them. Sci fi or B. That was probably the right decision, though. Even if it burned all of her uh, PP. Oh, it's level 20.
Nice, and she got a little bit of the psychic points back. Erp, it's hard to make the gross sounds that Mr. Belch does. I know I can't do it. I heard he's serving some Gygus guy. Ah, so honest. Smile, boing. Tired, but so good, ding. Alright, so I don't have much in the way of PP left. We're just gonna bash our way through, I think. Yeah. Oh, nice. What? Auto beat and gained? Oh, nice. Alright. I mean, I know it's going to end up with more stuff spawning, but... Hey! We got our PP back. Sweet. Is this unlimited? Or is this just the one? Dang. I should have probably healed before I, uh, went in there. Alright, um... You can bring it on. Auto win? No. Damn. Should be. I basically kill him. Oh, nice. Jeff gained 2 HP. Good job, Jeff. Oh, these guys are actually enemies. Slimy little pile and his cohorts. Hmm. Alright. Oh, no. Bye, Jeff. Alright. That's, a. Uh... We're gonna dial back, because I can't res him. Yeah. Not in the middle of the dungeon, and I'm pretty sure there's a boss fight in this dungeon since they're talking about Mr. Belch. Nice. Hi, guys. We're gonna just kind of keep going this way, if that's okay with you. Oh, your enemy's right. Status effects to everybody. Oh! 43 damage. Jeez. Nice.
Sigh freeze. 130 damage. Psy Gaming. It didn't work on him? Oh, screw you. Somebody will be able to bash your head in. Jeff leveled up for 3 HP. Sweet. Alright. And I won't screw this up this time. Who needs HP? Jeff and Ness. Alright, and now... I would like some of that back. Alright, and... We'll create another suspend point in here. down. Ow. Smash. Nice. All leveled up. Offense up alpha. Freeze B. They still hit hard. Ow. Can you stop now, please? Jesus. Jeebus, that's a lot of them. Alright. Aren't you the fly honey delivery boy? What's the password? Doesn't mean I don't trust you. Just say it. Say it now. Someone so quiet is either extremely shy or extremely dangerous. What a suspicious fellow. The, the password is staying quiet. Quite literally. Jeez. That's how we got in here. Ah, uh, the crying. All right, cool. Okay. Ow, ow, ow. All right, I don't have much in the way of healing items left, actually, so... Helps when you've been poisoned. Yeah. All that. Should recover power a bit. Um. Alright. Is that Mr. Belch? Okay, another save spot. Before I engage. Hi, Mr. Belch. I think. Yep, that confirms it. The year Ness? I see. York, York, York. There's a prophecy that a boy will destroy Master Gygus. <laughs> you make me laugh so hard. If Master Gygus is scared of someone, he would have to be worse than the greatest evil. I'll take you down big time. Get ready to feel the pain of true nausea. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Master Belch attacked. Oh, that's right. I wonder if the jar of fly honey actually helps during this fight. Can't hurt to try, right? Cypher's B. Not even try. 
Earth. Jeff felt nauseous. Ew. Offensive 50, defense 88, open to hypnosis. You grabbed the fly, honey. Cool. Cypher's beta. 305, nice. Lost his mind wolfing down the, the honey. Alright. Ah, uh, does it have to be like healing frickin' beta? Alright. <laughs> yeah, I only have alpha left, so. 20 more damage, ouch. Okay, it does have to be healing beta. Lame. Try thunder. I'll throw another bomb. Ah, oh, missed. I don't know how long that's gonna actually keep him distracted though, so. 219, nice, all right. 4,170 experience each. Nice. Looks like it was an even fight. Burp. But Master Gygus has managed to get that Mani Mani statue into Foreside. The city will soon be in worse condition than living in your own puke. Suffer, Spanky. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, okay. Sh sure. Whatever you say, sir. Okay, let's go. We're in a cave. It's a Mr. Saturn. I escaped. Zoom. Derp. Doing goody derp. Okay. Whatever you say so, Mr. Saturn. You worn down? Ah, doing burp, darf, stinky, pee I ate sure. Oh, we're back in, uh... Saturn Village. Hot Springs, rest here. Longer ladder can go to Hot Spring. Everything gets brighter. You got in and washed all the extremely dirty gunk off your body. You enjoyed the hot springs immensely. It made you feel reborn. H how long does this actually do anything for me? So it doesn't look like it. Drink coffee before go? Say yes to me? Say no to me? Bottoms up. Doing. Oh, is this the drug they call coffee? You've traveled very far from home. Do you remember how long and winding how your long and winding journey began with someone pounding at your door? It was Pokey, the worst person in your neighborhood, who knocked on the door that fateful night. On your way, you have walked thought and fought. Yet through all this, you have never lost your courage. You have grown steadily stronger, though you have experienced the pain of battle many times. You are no longer alone in your adventure. Mm. Paula, who is steadfast, kind, and even pretty, is always at your side. Jeff is with you as well. Though he is timid, he came from a distant land to help you. 
Ness, as you certainly know by now, you are not a regular young man. You have an awesome destiny to fulfill. The journey from this point will be long, and it will be more difficult than anything you have undergone to this point. Yet, I know you will be alright. When good battles evil, which side do you believe wins? Do you have the faith that good is triumphant? I mean, it depends. In video game worlds? Sure. In real life? Nah, evil's winning. One thing you must never lose is courage. If you believe in the goal you are striving for, you will be courageous. There are many difficult times ahead, but you must keep your sense of humor. Work through the tough situations and enjoy yourself. Coffee is a hell of a drug. When you have finished this cup of coffee, your adventure will begin again. Next time, you must pass through a vast desert and proceed to the big city of Foreside. Yes. Paula. Jeff. And Pooh. Wait, no, he's not here yet. I wish you luck. Ah. Uh, cool. Um. Yeah, I'm never drinking coffee again. Ever. Drink coffee before you go? No. Because I've seen things now. Go away. No. I just- you just took a picture of me. Not five minutes ago. Camera, ready, say, fuzzy pickles! Wow, what a great photograph. I don't even know what that said, man. Oh, your enemies. Okay, I probably shouldn't have come in here. Tried to get away. And succeeded. And succeed. Gosh darn it. I didn't have any PP to begin with, man. Just, just don't. Oh, shoot. Really? Hell yeah. Jeff got poisoned. Psy Magnet. Ow. Ow. Good lord. Crap. Indeed. Alright, we're gonna try to run away again. No? Okay, cool. 
There's no PP for you guys to steal. We're we're gonna keep trying to run away. Yeah, cool. We're gonna take Paula. Alert! Jeff's condition is critical. He will collapse if his condition isn't treated. Be careful. It made you feel reborn. Sweet. That brought her fully back. And gave her full PP, seriously? And she's the one that can't heal, right? Appreciate I so happy happy zoom. I right. all home zoom. Okay. Appreciate you're still just gonna sit in my way, huh? Alright, that's fine. Whatever. Hi hi, you come buying, you can sell too. Um No, I I just kinda want some consumable something to eat maybe. Yeah. That's a Ness and yeah, I uh, I want to buy a few more of the peanut cheese bars. Uh-huh. I don't know how much they heal. But, um... We're, we're just gonna get, like, two for everyone, and we'll find out afterwards how much they heal. Alright, cool. Um, a hundred HP. Gosh darn. Alright, cool. Is it safe to use this cave? Yes, okay. Excuse me. I go rest now. Yeah, I want to slumber. Broken air gun. Magnum air gun. Nice. It's an upgrade. <clears throat> okay. Okay. We go back up. Cool. Now, let's not go drink any more coffee. We're just gonna go up here. Ugh. Right, okay. Actually not, we're we're gonna go all in. Hey, 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 leave our sigh alone. Fire. Ow! Jeff did not appreciate that. Alright, side gaming B. Okay, that killed all three of them. And yes, Jeff. I will heal you.
Alright, and now to kill the evil shredding mushroom. Why do evil mushrooms strut? Who knows? We just know that they do. Apparently. There you go, Jeff. Goodness gracious, man. Yeah, I guess we'll just let her nuke them. Uh-oh. out. Wasn't even that big of a nuke, so it was well worth it. Nah, we're not going to waste any actual... Oh, shoot. Dang it. Just keep spreading. Hey, hey. Leave our sigh alone. Started with two, and it's gonna keep getting two. Alright. Ow. Enough with the pathetic attacks, man. Yes, it's level 26. Paula level 23. Jeff level 24. Nice. Sincerely, I'm not sure where we're going. Oh, Paula. You need... some HPs. Magnet, stop trying to steal PP. Oh my gosh, you stole a lot. You stole from both of them? I'm not a fan of that. of slumber inside. What does that do? Must be equipped as other. Increases your defense and luck. Jeff, my dude, you need armor. Oh, another one of those wonderful things. I bet it's a boss fight. You finally got here. This is the third Your Sanctuary location, but it's mine now. Take it from me, if you dare. Is that just a recolor of um, Mr. Belch? Because I feel like it is.
But if it is, all right, we're just gonna try and nuke him. Cypher's beta. Ow. Psy gaming beta. Opal sprouts are dead. Bottle rocket didn't work. Fudge, really? And that means I wasted it. Gosh darn. All right. Cypher is beta. For 153. Ness was diamondized. Oh, he can't move at all. And now I have the option to auto fight and run away. Um. We'll just keep nuking, I guess. Cypher's beta. So I can't do anything with Ness now. Cypher's beta. He's taking away his turns, if nothing else. Cypher's beta. Come on. Oh, Jeff was diamondized. Cypher's beta. Lucky. They had stayed diamondized. If, if Paula had, I'm guessing. Holy crap. Paula gained 34,000 XP each. Are they considered dead? Psi Magnet Omega. Thunder Beta. Oh, she just gained the XP what should have been for three people. Good lord. Oh yeah, they're, um... I have no option to sigh. And, and Paula leads the party now. Fantastic. Great. The, the frick is diamondized. Power of the Milky Well flowed into Ness. Ness was revived. <laughs> Ness thought he heard his mother from far away. She said, Be a thoughtful, strong boy. Ness's soundstone recorded the melody of the Milky Well. Oh dang, it healed everyone. Nice. Nice. And the evil mushroom and his evil ways were stopped. So did she actually out-level like Ness? I'm curious now. Yeah, Ness is 26, Paula is 27. Because she gained like 30,000 XP. It's nice to be high level. Everything just kind of runs away. <laughs> if it helps, I'd like to just leave. I don't want to fight you if you guys had gotten out of the way properly. We wouldn't have had to fight. <laughs> yeah, 
Can you stop trying to steal the PP from my characters? Hooray! Not that I needed it, but sure. My dudes. You're in the way. Sci Fire B. Sci Gaming B. And thus, they were very dead. I didn't want to fight you. You did it to yourself. Yes, I would like to slumber. Broken iron became slime generator. Items for Jeff. Sprays a sticky substance that stops the enemy from moving. Can be used many times. Oh, hello, bug. You're very brave compared to the rest of, you know, the enemies. Given that you didn't die to a smash from Paula says something, though, so I'll give you the credit. Because it's due. Back to three we go. Hooray. The bug is still brave as heck. He vented a terrible odor. How did we not kill him on turn one? That's baffling. No, 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 no. Right. 47, yikes. 72, yikes, sir. <laughs> sci fire beta. Oh no, there. They can tank a sci fire. Um. Ness, why did you crave steak instead of healing Jeff? Freeze beta. Yeah, okay, that'll kill him. Thank you. Okay, good lord. Hypnosis Omega.
Fire Alpha. Gaming Beta. All attacks. Ness suddenly thought about his mom. Is he too powerful of a Pokemon? Will he not obey me now? Is that the logic here? Because that's really dumb. When he just decides to, oh, I'm not gonna do anything. Oh no. Oh, Shiza, really? Fire beta. Just kill them all. Side gaming alpha. Fire alpha. Good job, Jeff. You really came through there. There was a sugar packet. Yay. Oh, cool. I honestly didn't think I could fit through that, so... Frickin'. Uh, Ness lost all motivation to battle. Ness suddenly thought about his mom. What is this bullcrap? I guess I will have to go to a phone so Ness can call his mom and stop being depressed. Good lord. Alright. So we'll keep going south and hope that there's a bridge or somewhere to go at this point. Ouch. Ness suddenly thought about his mom. Fire Alpha. Present, broken spray can, Paula took it. Yay. There's a cave down here. Cool. Hopefully this leads back to Threed. I legitimately did not remember how I got to uh, Saturn Village. 
or Saturn Valley or whatever it's called. But I think it was through here. Guess we'll find out. There were a lot more enemies before. Oh hey, the town seems a lot nicer. Thank you for bringing peace and happiness to Threed. Peace. Love. I really didn't think those kids could have saved the town. Who would have ever imagined it? Since the leader of the monsters is gone, the ghosts in the tunnel have disappeared. The buses can get through now. I won't forget you. Won't you come back to Threed sometime? Insecticide spray. Hooray. Alrighty. Repeatedly. I want to go through the desert and on to the big city. Thank you. You're heroes. That rocks. Sweet. Alright. I guess let's see if there's anything new at the shop. too loud. I mean, Jeff, presumably. Alright, cool. Let's go to the drugstore. We won because of our brains, guts, and togetherness. Wow, what a rush. Hard hat for Ness and Jeff. You cannot buy the jar of fly honey. Eleven thousand? What? What's wrong? You sound so sad. Are you homesick? Well, I knew there would be days like this. It must make you feel better listening to your mom's sweet voice. So, do you feel any better? Well, I'd better get going. I'm in the middle of my ironing. Bye. Ness got over being homesick. Literally, that's a thing. Huh. Wow. Alright. You know what? That's 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 cool. I I get it. It is kids. All right, let's go rest at the hotel before. Yeah. 
go rest at the hotel first, I guess. I came from Foreside by bus. Buffalo? Oh, I, yeah, I saw lots. A girl in Foreside called me. There's a really popular band there now. I think they're called Runaway Fire. Not Runaway 5? Actually, let me go find out how much it's gonna cost. 180. Alright, I need 90 more dollars. Trust. <laughs> Hold up, what? Slumber coin is fifteen extra defense versus the hard hat? I just wasted three hundred dollars. Whatever, it's fine. Uh-huh. I need the money to pay for the Escargo Express so I can clear out some of my inventory space. <laughs> yep, I can cover exactly that. Jar of fly honey. Yeah, just just take them. Ah. Finally, we can breathe the de breathe deep the outside air now that the zombies are gone. Ah, the outdoors is so refreshing. Skip sandwich. Mmm, tasty. Alright. Let us go on our adventure to the desert. Because I, th I think that it said it was to the right. Healed up and ready to go. No problem here. you. Wet towel. Right. Cool. 
running it in, mister. It's 210 a night. No, thank you. Mr. Baseball Bat. Deluxe Frying Pan. Okay. The coins of slumber are really good. It's 3,500. So that's 4,100. 5,300. All right. I'm carrying a lot of cash on me. Yep, I'll sell the copper bracelet. Yep. That too. Big frying pan. Paula. One for Ness and one for Jeff. And I guess the coins of slumber. <sighs> Wasted the money for the hard hats, but it's fine. Alright. I guess let me... I don't even know what this does. Let me go see what this does first. Maybe it helps with the sweating effect. It's great for those times that you get sunstroke. Shoot. Alright, um... Hey, counter monkey. Yeah. I'm not buying. I would like to continue to sell. I don't know what else, but, um... Alright, skip sandwich director's cut. Alright, um... We'll sell the regular skip sandwich. Saw the spray. Protractor. Toy air gun. All right. Um. Since I assume being in the desert, we're going to get that a lot. We'll get everybody a couple. If I have to sell them later, I'll 
I'll sell them later. <laughs> Alright, and we will create a suspend point here. And head off. Alright, and we're all sweating, and I guess we're just gonna head east. This traffic jam is taking forever. Man, do I need to go. I feel sorry for the guys behind me, but I'm so bent. I'm leaving my car here and walking instead. I heard that a little ways ahead is a herd of buffalo running across the road. I was gonna see my girlfriend in Foreside. At this pace, I'll be a hundred years old by the time I get there. Can we not? We can't even use the road. We have to just straight go around. Yeah, I guess so. Hey, friendo. Shh, don't talk too loud. What do you want? Zip gun. Yeah. Magnum air gun. I don't want to buy that junk. Alright, so, ran on. I thought the moles were friendly. Hey, it's the monkey. Cuckoo, -cuckoo. welcome. Our paradise exists beneath this hole. Hala Rama is great and kind, and he knows everything. He made us the underground rooms. Goodbye, mushroom, sir. Alarama is now fasting and practicing silent meditation. He is abstaining from anything that would make him sick or smelly. Anything sick or smelly, you say? Actually, I have no idea if I have anything that would do that. Lame. Thought that might be able to make him smelly at least. Once we find something that can make him smelly, we'll come back. Ah, swizzle sticks. Oh, swizzle sticks, two of them. Cute little UFO. Fire Beta. Crested Buka. How about Psy Gaming Beta? We'll just bash. Let's see how that works. Ugh. Crested Buka was defeated. The UFO dodged. 
and healed. And then was destroyed. Enemy left a pizza. Hooray! All right. Actually, just go ahead and heal Paula since. Hello, it's your dad. You've been out there a long time now. It may be none of my business, but don't you think it'd be a good idea to take a break? No. Ah, I see. Well, it doesn't make me happy, but I understand your point about the fate of the world being at stake. Okay. Hey. It's a double burger inside. Uh-oh. Tell us, uh, follow Sunstroke was cured. I don't even know what the Sunstroke really did, does. All right. We'll just bash. No point in wasting PP. Uh, they go down that quick. Jeff leveled up. Hooray. Shiza, really? I shouldn't have tried to walk through them. That was foolish of me. We're just going to beat the crap out of- HOLY CRAP! Alright. Well, a, a good level up. A very good level up. Holy crap. Who had the extra peanut cheese bars? A cup of life noodles inside. Hooray. You guys are sweating an awful lot. Alright, cool. That's a bunch of stuff. We're gonna attempt to drop the nuke on them. I don't have a gun. So. Alright. So, fire B. Oh shoot, he hit us with Sci-Fire. A hey, yikes. Paul is down. Shoot. That's why you have a cup of life noodles.
All right. Whew. As sea monkeys live in the sea, desert monkeys live in the desert. I mean desert, not desert. I am happy that there are animals in the desert, aren't you? No, not at all. Animals are dangerous. Frick you all are, but holy... Zog, nabbit. Nope. We are out of this place. No, thank you. I would like to run away now. Nope, still trying to run away. Alright, cool. Yeah. Really? Requires a beta? No, go away. Go the fine, I will fight you head on. Of course you had a, a freaking scorpion with you. Of course Ness got poisoned. I mean There's a cookie. Yeah, no, no. Yep. It's a freaking cookie. I don't need it. Alright, um... I hate you. Why are you even doing this? What is wrong with you? Alright, um... I think they had an inn here. Yeah, that'd be wonderful. Let me stay at the inn. <laughs> yeah. We cannot buy the Magnum Air Gun. Um. Yeah, feel free. Well, we're just trying to go around, so I guess if we stick to the... No. I will fight you head on. Screw right off. You know what? No. I don't want to fight you. You can live. I will fight you head on too, Mr. Scorpion.
Sorry, Sculpion. I don't know why it's called a Sculpion, but sure. Do you just poison Ness seriously? I'm mad. I'm mad online and offline, but... I mean, I imagine it's not going to be as simple as just sticking close to the bottom. There's probably a maze I have to go through or something, but... Paula, use wet towel! Big bottle rocket, no, no, go away. I'm not going near you. Dusty Dunes headquarters for finding gold. This hole's great. Good hole, good hole, good hole. First, someone asked me to dig for buried gold. I began to feel like I was obligated to find it. Man, am I starving. Uh, guess you're gonna have the burger. If I find the gold, I'll give it to you. Oh, I don't actually have the money for that, so... It's a small house, but please, stay the night. Cool. The other hole didn't do me any good. I'm not going to trust the hole. We'll just keep trying to go around. Hey! Tunnel. Oh, you are still suffering the effects of Sunstroke. I'm glad it works that way. Danger, do not stand in the street. Read the schedule from the sidewalk. Ha, hilarious. Alright. The city of Forsyth has developed quite a bit since Mr. Geldegard Monatoli hit the big time. It's been good for the city. Monatoli Grand Hotel, $75 per night for a single room. He's a lot of blue people. Not that I'm trying to judge. It's a cranky lady with a creepy, creepy face. She's extra cranky, even. Smash. She wielded a shopping bag and dealt 91 damage. What is this bull crap? Defense down, Alpha. Hooray. Hi. Sixty-seven damage to Ness, even. Oh, and she dodges too. Great. Well, now she's no longer extra cranky, at least. I guess. The 
map look like? Ugh, foresight, alright. A lot of junk like this bulletin board at the junk shop busted up, located in the back alley of the department store. No one know anything. Grr. Monotoli's toadies stole everything from me, including my house and land. They are evil incarnate. Lawyers, policemen, everyone that follows Monotoli. They're all his toadies. No matter how you fight him, you can't win. Yeah, yeah, I'm okay. Just leave me alone to cry into my cappuccino. Nosy. The perspective is definitely weird for Foreside. Seems like it's just for decoration. What? Does Mr. Geldegard Monotoli come here often? Hello, time to get up. It could never happen. Well, that's not actually true. Kids shouldn't be drinking espresso. You shouldn't be hanging around in here. I used to be Monotoli's employer. Then I realized his schemes made my company go bankrupt. Now I'm homeless. I'm surprised you talked to an ordinary guy like me. I have no information or items to help you out. Don't you think it's natural for a guy like me to be here? Let me quiz you. There are five apples. If you eat one, how many are left? Five minus one is four. Master Pokey's maid, Electra, is made to order. Oh, puns aren't funny either. No, they're not. He knocked on the wall instead of the restroom. Interesting. <laughs> Alright, let's go check out Mr. Monotoli's hotel. Yes, sir, are you staying here tonight? Thanks for being so generous with your tips. One night's stay will cost you two twenty-five. service exclusive to our hotel only. I'm here to read you today's headline. Over 70% of Forside citizens support Monotoli. Hey, you. If you meet a beautiful, seductive woman who's looking for me, tell her hi. Right. I'll be sure to do that, friend. Uh, the city of Foresight has developed quite a bit since Monotoli hit a good time. Right, you already said that. Uh, the Runaway Five from Tucson seemed very popular. I heard that the Tapala Theater is always full. Hey, there's Tapala. Nice. 
What happened to those guys digging for buried gold? If they found gold, it would be worth a huge amount of money. They'd be able to pay off a million dollar debt easy. I mean, probably. If I were them, I'd go to Japan and live it up. Ah. You wanna buy a ticket? 30 bucks, please. I'm sorry, sir. We don't just give away tickets. Alright, I guess I get 30 bucks. Back to the Monotoli Theater. Or the Tapala Theater. Whatever we want to call it today. Yep. Okay, sure. Thanks, please hurry. The show will be starting any moment. So, you're a Runaway 5 fan, huh? What? Excuse me? No, no. This band owes me a million bucks. If they break their contract, they'll be in deep doo-doo with the police. The police would probably say, hey, you guys, or something like that. Unless you're able to pay a million dollars on their behalf, you'd have to find buried gold, or you would never be able to pay such a huge sum. Ho, 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 ho. How do they get that much in debt, though? Why is everyone in the audience blonde? No, no, this is a, this is a serious question. Why? There, there is not a single non-blonde person here except for Ness. What the heck? When Ness arrives, the Runaway Five told me to let him in. So please, come in. We're so helpless, really helpless and hopeless. Again, we've been cheated by the theater owner. We're stuck here with a phony contract. We owe you guys so much, sorry. We know how to sing, but we don't know how to handle money or woman. Do wop do wop. To meet Gildegard Monatoli, you'll need our help. I don't know why, it's just a hunch. All right, I guess we'll uh, get to see the Runaway 5 show again. Cool, I guess.
Well, that that was a uh, that was a show. Put that back in the back room again that quick. Yep. All right, cool. Oh. I I guess we get another show. What? Goodness. Okay. Alright, that's that's enough. Let's just get out of this place, I guess. Alright, I know there was a guy in the desert digging for gold, so... See if he did anything with his... Oh, hi. How you doing? I, I didn't need the heals, but that's cool. to the desert. Hooray. I am a broken slot machine, but the Sanchez brothers and their friend are a cheerful trio. They'll make you happy. thousand dollars <throat> all right cool It's always good to carry a little bit of cash on you, just in case.
Yeah, sure, go for it. Bye, Mr. Mole. There you go, Jeff. Freaking sunstroke, man. <laughs> oh, that, that hole looks a lot bigger than it was. I'm watching them dig for a while. I wonder what they'll find. If they have a live broadcast from the dig, I can check the dig while relaxing on the floor. Though you may not believe it, I'm a healer. If you have some illness, I can try to cure you. I have lots of work to do, but I can't seem to move. I am very hungry and thirsty. I would like a wet towel. That is definitely the solution to both of those things. problem digging until I found a maze. Lots of monsters appeared, so I couldn't proceed. There's five big moles. If I beat the monsters, I can continue on. I think I have a bleeding ulcer from worrying too much. I'm helpless to really do anything. <laughs> oh, a snake? No, they're easy. Oh. Thirsty coil snake. Yeah, but that poisons. Ow. You know what? I'm not even gonna heal the poison until I actually kill you. Because I'm gonna have to heal poison from everybody, so pretty much irrelevant. Healing beta. I'm gonna burn through Nessa's PP just existing in here. Yeah. Noose man and his cohort, Mad Duck. Bye, noose man. Noose man became tame. No thanks. Ugh. I'm actually gonna have to fight you, aren't I? Cypher's beta. Yeah. I'd rather burn some PP with her than have to heal everyone of their poison again. Twenty-nine. 
paralysis omega, sweet. Big bottle rocket. It's Jeff. Big bottle rocket. Give it to Jeff. I mean, we can probably all use it, but... Croissant. Picnic lunch. Ooh, do I get to come along too? No thanks, Mr. Spider. I'm good. Uh, I'm one of the masters of the whole. There are five masters in all. We are all moles, of course. I believe I'm the third strongest among us. Take your best shot. I, I didn't even mean to start that fight. Number three is the name in the back. All right. Um, we just won't play around with you. Sci freeze. Beta. He has a power shield. Alright. Oh, big bottle rocket's just a win, huh? I guess so. Alright. 5k XP each. Sigh, Caramel. Oh. Gigantic Ant has armor. All right. Cool. Fire beta it is. Oh, paralyzing uh again. Super bomb. Jeff takes it. Cool. Good job, Jeff. This place is a freaking maze. I'm really the third strongest master. I'll destroy you now. Oh, he's still paralyzed. Interesting. See how hard it will be to defeat you. Ow! Bottle rocket didn't work on him. Shoot. Alright, um.
That is your max hit points, so... Alright. I healed you! What? Son of... Seven and he solidified. Nice. Okay, cool. Ness is level thirty. Paula is level thirty. Jeff is level twenty eight. That's capsule inside. Okay. It had no visible effect. What heals paralysis? I mean, I sincerely am not sure. Uh, recover power a bit. Poisoned or feeling nauseous. Yeah, I have no idea, man. Alright. You want to be in a line? That's great. Fire beta. Slide along the ground, don't actually walk. Perkins. Snakes, man. Yeah, going all out. Just nuke the frickin' snakes. Can't <coughs> deal with their poison. Of course, there's more of them. Ness, just uh, sit there and look pretty. Yeah. Yeah, go ahead, poison one of us, it's fine. I mean, I'd, honestly, I would have preferred if you'd poisoned, um, Ness, but that's- this is fine. We might have removed his paralysis. And then, using the left of it, you can heal her. Left of it, correct. Cool. Escape. I must go find a doctor. I'm in pain.
the paralysis is truly devastating. Alright, sure. Whatever, man. I will recover from this in here. Hey, friend. Can I borrow your bed? Thank you. Nest still can't feel anything. Why is it not uh, feeling strange and uncontrollable crying? Why did I bother getting the wet towels? He can just cure it for 5 PP. Christ. Alright, um... Well, I think we're actually going to tackle the cave next Wednesday. Um, I actually have to go early tonight. Unfortunately, um, so I'd like to thank you all for watching, for everybody who did tune in tonight. Um, this was Alaris with Earth, <laughs> Alaris with Earthbound. Uh, tomorrow um, will be, I believe, Bugaboo playing some more Act Razor Renaissance, um, taking the place of Valagan. And then on Friday, we'll probably be Trinoya with Octopath Traveler, or a multiplayer stream, depending on player availability. Um, so again, thank you all for watching, and I guess we will see you next time. Have a good night, everybody.